G'day, I'm Jake from Make Science Fun. Thanks for joining me today. Here I am standing in front of this big pile of like twigs and sticks and dirt and stuff like that, which was put here by the world's stupidest bird. The Australian brush turkey. It's this big black bird. It's got this yellow thing hanging off this ugly red head. These birds live along the eastern coast of Australia. They dig through the, the detritus on the on the ground, the leaves and the twigs looking for like little bugs and insects and fruit to eat. But they also are megapodes and they make these big mounds to lay their eggs in. And so the male spends weeks or months building a mound in order to get a female to lay its pretty big egg in. Now a bush turkey a few months ago started building a mound on the other side of this fence. And these mounds are like four meters wide and a meter high, but the problem is it ran out of material to make his mound. And so what he did, he came over to my place and he started dragging all the material out of my gardens across my driveway to build, to get to his mound. The problem is there's a big fence in the way and he hasn't been able to get any of his stuff to his mound. Now that is stupid. And so, I don't know, I think, he's, I think he's just totally perplexed by this whole concept of a fence. I see him like sitting on the top of the fence, like looking at the, the leaves on this side and then looking at the mound on that side and like, I don't think he can actually work it out what the problem is. But anyway, I think he might, you know, have just decided that his mound is big enough and so he's dug a hole in it and he's like strutting around looking for a female. Um, and who knows, he might be able to pass on his stupid genes. I'm not too sure we'll find out if there's any little brush turkeys um, hatching in the next few months or so. When these brush turkeys hatch, they can actually fly within the first few hours, unlike most birds. Yes, brush turkeys can actually fly. In fact, I've seen them up in this tree. I've seen 18 at once in a tree at my place. 18. They're supposed to be like endangered. And there was 18 in a tree. They're all over the place. They make such a mess, people would love to get rid of these things. The reason they're endangered is about 50 years ago, there was a Great Depression, and uh, people didn't have jobs, they couldn't buy food. Anyway, they saw these brush turkeys, which were basically like, you know, walking KFC buckets. And uh, quite tasty, lots of meat on them, and so they'd uh, catch them and cook them. What happened was, you know, they started going extinct. And so a law was passed that, you know, you weren't allowed to kill brush turkeys anymore. Now everyone's got jobs and food and so on. Don't need to catch brush turkeys. And they've gone prolific all over the place. I hope you've learned a little bit about brush turkeys today. And uh, thanks for joining me and I'll see you guys again soon. Bye for now. Ah, the world's dumbest bird. The brush turkey. <laughs>